Quick, graph y equals 1 half times the square root of x by hand two different ways. This is part of the family of functions series. You will need graph paper or you can download this PDF and print it. Press pause as needed any time during this video. The first way is with the radical dance. Normally we start at the origin and here we will also because a half times the square root of zero is zero. From this point we do the radical dance but will be modified by a factor of one half this coefficient. Normally it's right one up one but here it's going to be right one up a half. Normally right four up two but in this case will be right four up one. And normally square root of nine is three would be right nine up three but here will be right nine up three halves. Connect the points and we get that radical looking graph. Comparing it to the parent function, you can see that it's shorter because it goes up more slowly because of that one half. Also, you'll notice that the blue y value times a half is the green y value at this point and at this point, in fact, at all the points. Second way is using a table. So this is our traditional table for y equals the square root of x. We're going to keep the x values the same, but multiply each y value by one half, that coefficient. So zero times a half is zero, so the origin is on the graph. One times a half is a half, so one comma a half. Go ahead and finish these last two points and graph them, and then pause to do this and resume when you're ready. Two times a half is one, so four comma one. And three times a half is three halves, nine comma one and a half. Connect the points and we'll get that square root looking graph and we compare it to the parent function in blue. Now you try one. Graph y equals one third times the square root of x. Use either method or both for the practice. Press pause to do this and then resume when you're finished to check your answer. And here's your answer in green compared to the blue parent function.